it's Brigzar, and we're going to do a Lego haul. And we got three packages and from three people that all have a presence on YouTube. Uh, one is Lego for Chris, who I ordered a some parts from his store. The other one is Max Kroos, who has a BrickLink store called 3001 A Brick Oddity. And the other one is Roger Coat, who also has a brick link store called Skyline Bricks and they all came yesterday and I was not able to get to them because I had to sleep uh, had a really rough night the day before but anyway you don't want to hear about that you want to see what we got so let's start off with Lego for Chris okay Lego for Chris everybody knows him he's got a cool city he does Lego hauls and a lot of his hauls are from me so it's about time I return the favor. Now, it's not the first package I've received from Chris. We've made trades and things like that. But uh, this is the first time I've bought from his BrickLink store. And I'll show you what I got. I got peanuts! Now, um, first of all, we got a couple of these. These are these little creator poly bags they were on clearance at the lego store but when i went they were all gone and i didn't get one and he had a whole bunch of them in store so i thought i'd buy two of them that's for my personal collection not for resale and then i got some parts it's funny these some of these parts here i'll show you um i ordered these yellow one by fours uh, with the studs on the side. I need those for something special that I'm going to be building. Don't you love how yellows don't ever... Yellow is one of the worst color fest colors in the that LEGO makes. Um, there'll be different shades of yellow. Like these two. These are different colors, but they're the same. They're yellow. There's no other yellow this shade. But they're different probably made in different factories but um i have something i'm going to be building i needed a, about 15 or 20 of these i can't remember and so i did that's not why i went to a store but i went ahead and bought them and then when i was building the cargo train <laughs> i noticed it had a bunch of them i could have stolen from that but i want to keep the cargo train built i got some doors these white doors that i needed boy i'm having a hard time with the focus sorry about that I got some corner one by two bricks. I got these hitches. Why does it seem dark in here today? Is it because of that backboard in the background. I got one by three tiles. These are all these are for the one project. This is for a different one. And I got a female head. And that's for that project right there, as well as these. No, no that is but this is for this other project here that I'm working on so I basically went I just needed a few items to build Emmett's car and this I need the headlights and the doors so that's what I went to get and then those are for another project that will be coming up later it's super secret so I can't tell you what it is but that's all from Lego for Chris thank you Chris good job Got to go leave him some good feedback. And that's a pretty good idea, putting your peanuts in a bag where they don't go get all over everything. I should probably do that. You learn from everybody. All right, next up, where do you go? Okay, we'll do Roger from Skyline Bricks. Sent me this. And we will open it up. Now, this is close to his sig fig. It's not his sig fig, but it's close. I don't have the right head, and his hair is a little more fluffy on that sig fig, but um, I looked on his YouTube page, and I subscribed to him. I thought I was already subscribed to him. Uh, oh, look, some more vintage stuff. Oh, and he sent his sig fig. <laughs> You're just going to have to leave. <laughs> Check it out. Let's see here. He wrote me a note. Enclosed are a few more classic space minifigures. 
they are not complete. Also, I sent a Lego skateboard helmet for they might be bricks. Sent you my sick fig. This again is for all the good ideas I get from your YouTube channel. Thank you. That's from Skyline Brick. So that's pretty cool. Show you his sick fig. Yeah, that does look more like him. Got the um, sand, looks like sand blue pants, solid black torso, uh, goatee and eyebrows and glasses and the hair. The um, that's um, dark reddish brown hair, ruffled a little bit. Looks just like him. It actually has a good resemblance. So, and he sent me classic space man in yellow, another one in yellow. Cool. Um, oh look, there's some uh, maxi figure parts there, and some I zoomed in, didn't I? Some bl blue air tanks. Let's zoom out. The skateboard for they might be bricks and the helmet. So I'll, I'll give that to him. He's at school right now as I'm filming this. So that's from. Oh, sorry about that. Hope that didn't hurt. Skyline bricks. So I got his sick figure. I made one before I opened it, just kind of get close to it and. And he sent one, so that was pretty neat. Thank you, Roger. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm going to have to start labeling my sig figs. They're going to get harder to, harder to keep up with. So the last one is from Max. You see that on the torso? He's got that on his page. That's the... Um, it's actually the Railway Brickster. And it's appropriate this has the 2x4 brick. If anybody needs the 2x4 brick on his torso, it's Max. Max is, to me, the unofficial LEGO 2x4 brick expert. Um, he has probably more varieties of 2x4 bricks than anybody. I use them for my color chart. I have about 70. And oh, um, Max probably has a couple of hundred or more because of the marbled bricks and other things. And then also all the other varieties. So what did I get? Uh-oh. Alright. Alright, I got this little sports car. I got it because of the figure that's in it. It's got the, there are several of these red jackets with the space logo on them in different sets. So I'm trying to get a few of the different sets, but that's why I got it. I like that torso. It's got the space logo on a red jacket. So I got that. He sent me this. Now I already have trans yellow and trans red on my color chart, but they are frosted. These do not have a frosted interior, so that's cool. These are harder to find. Look at that, no frosting on the inside. It's totally trans red. I think I actually you can see that too. So, got that. I got a magenta. This is a new color. Probably be more readily available now that they're putting them in like the friend sets. That's magenta. I did not have a 2x4 magenta. I had some 1x4s that were magenta. I'm going to mix everything up. Alright. This is another one that I already have in my color chart. But I stole it from the bank. Literally. <laughs> um, the the uh, city bank that we have. It has two of these in it. And I stole one from my color chart. And they might be bricks wanted it back. So he put it back on the bank. So I need this for my color chart, the dark blue. It was in the city bank. Here is a weird color. I'm going to have to go. This is kind of almost a um, opaque orange color. It's weird. It's got the old Lego logo. It's just orangish white. That's weird. And here's a kind of a um, I 
This video is going to be way too long. Weird yellow color. And trying to get all these out of the bag. I should edit this, but I won't. Got two of these. These are trans blue non frosted. Cool. And this is the most special one in the lot. Trans black two by four. Let's focus. Focus on the front. Uh oh, I dropped it. That's and it's the old style there. But a trans black. So some cool things, and then he sent in a couple extras. I think these are freebies. Oh wait, I forgot. I almost forgot another one. Yeah, that's kind of a milky white <coughs> there, and a dark red here. And one more rarity. <coughs> Excuse me. Flat silver. Awesome. Flat silver. That is cool. So that is all from 3001 Brick Oddity. So, <clears throat> there you go. That's my Lego haul. Some pretty unusual stuff as I like to get. I'm sorry I bored you by making this long video. But now i got to get started building some stuff. Thanks for watching. This is Bricks Art.